What's going on, guys? If you tuned in, you must more than likely probably caught the last video where I was talking about the, the how to make working belts. Now I'm about to show y'all how to do RGB lights. I'm so tired of people. You know what? I'm not saying that I'm tired. I'm just gonna show you how to do it. All right. So let's go ahead and just jump straight on in. Um, also with the working belt tutorial I showed you, you can retexture your own belt, make it look more realistic. You know what I'm saying? I just put a texture up there just because of time's sake. But you guys, let's go ahead and get to it. Once you got your light separated or whatnot, you need to make a dummy like how we did in the um of the last video. Make a little dummy going up here, name it miscellaneous underscore whatever, and drop whatever you want to RGB, right? So for me, what I would want the RGB would be actually all of this actually. I want all of this to RGB. Hold on. So what we're going to do is we're going to drop this extra 5 in here too. Star ceiling. Just made that like that right quick. Alright, cool. Once you made your dummy, you dropped everything inside your dummy. You're going to highlight it, alright? You're going to go to move. You're going to put just X only. Make sure pivot is turned off. You're going to go right on up here and you're going to move axes. Make sure you got man, all right, there we go. And now we're just gonna move axis. Let's see, here we go. Okay, my shit ain't moving. Hold on. There we go. So I generally tell you to do it somewhere. You don't have to go this far out. I do because everything is somewhat spaced out. Once you get done, hit mirror. Come on up here. You need to go ahead and make sure you have geometry, mirror geometry, mirror axis selected. Once you got that selected or whatnot, then all you need to do is click it. And you see how mine is acting right now? Ah, oh, there it go. Boom. Now, see how I just mirrored it? Mirror geometry, mirror axis, make sure what you call is off. Boom. Once you do that, now the next thing is see, again, this is star ceiling and this is what you call it. So you need to find your textures or whatnot. See, I got two different textures going on, but I'm gonna make everything count for what it is, alright? So bring up your material browser. Go Google search some textures, man. It ain't that hard. Find your RGB texture that you want. Add it in there. Prime example, I already got one pre-downloaded that I found and I cut and cropped, uh, cropped it and everything. This is what I want. Boom. Got it in there, right? See that? You see that right there? Ooh, wee. You see that? Now, then, uh, since I got some other shit going on, I got to do it with all my shit. Let's see. Yeah. See that shit? Yeah. Now what we're going to do is we're going to do mapping, edit UV, just in case. So I can set and line this shit up the way I want it. For me personally, you don't have to be perfect at this, guys. You do not have to be perfect at this, guys. You do not have to be perfect with it. Just get it somewhere. Look, see, see how that lined up right there? Boom. Just get it somewhere where you're going to want it. Let's go to UV Mapper. And now you see my ceiling, you see the lights, and to be honest with you, everything in the sense is laid out the way I want it to be. So what you're going to do is you're going to, because it, all it's going to do is run, the, the texture is going to run to the right, boom, boom, boom. So all this shit right here is going to be boom, 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 hitting together, so it's cool. Now, vehicle light admissive is all well and good, guys, but that's not what we're using today. We're going to be using... Uh, let's see where we at. Emissive, vehicle generic. Here we go. Track 2 emissive. Again, guys, you need this in order to make it move and do what it do. You hear me? You're going to need this in order to make it do what it do. So, 
Um, and then if you want, like, see how you see how I got all that color going on right here with the star ceiling thing here, but I don't got all that color going on with the lights, right? If you want more color, all you got to do is literally scale the shit bigger. That's it. See? There you go. See that? You get it somewhere where you want it. Boom. That's about right. That's about good. You know what I'm saying? Boom. Call it a day. And then that's it, guys. You go ahead and export your car. Let me drag all my shit back in because I got a lot of shit going on here. Boom. So now that I got all my stuff back in, you see it's going to be hanging outside your car. But when you get in game, everything should be alright, see? So, also this car will be available on the website for sale. Keep checking back on it. I promise to you, it will be up on the website for sale. Boom. All right, we're good to go. Now, let's go um, make my, go drag my little DLC file I got going right quick yeah, yeah. should be at the bottom uh huh boom 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 let's drag this over here right quick downloads boom texture uh-huh so we gotta add that texture that we downloaded boom boom save and so hopefully everything should work out right you see how that is look at that all that rgb nice madness okay so now all i need to do is set it inside my game Guys, also, if you don't know how to add, add, do add-ons, boom. This is a good way for you to learn right here. Uh-huh. All right. So let's go into the game and go check it out, man. Let's go into the game. The really good game. Oh, shit. We're at eight minutes right now. Hopefully everything is moving right and does everything is doing like it's supposed to. And like I said, guys, don't be discouraged to, you know, want to jump in Z Modeler and learn it and, you know, kind of do this stuff. Like I said, it's easy, bro. It, it took me years and years, and to this day, I'm still learning stuff, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm actually in Blender now, making parts and everything like that. You know, I'm, I'm doing my thug dizzle, doing my shit, you know? Yeah. But, um, yeah. This is just a good way to help everybody out. But if you feel like, you know what, fuck it, I don't want to do it. I just want to go buy some shit. And then, cool, you can always buy stuff. idea is to the idea is to guy down you know try to help everybody learn something and do something new you know what I'm saying so with that being said sorry that my computer is in window mode right now don't really care but 
let's go on out here and see if everything is set right because i was messing around with wheels and all that good stuff so hopefully <laughs> this car ain't doing the roly poly -oly. and it is yep because i didn't reset the parent but as you can see you see the lights you know what let me fix this car <laughs> let me jump out of z mod and go fix this car right quick it's a simple re reset the parent on the goddamn dummies i'm tripping see something like that ah uh, that's another reason shit fucked up reset the world should be fixed now yeah we all fuck up i just gave y'all a little tutorial how to reset if you got them that same issue i had with my wheels right then i just showed y'all how to fix it easily the reset the parent method let's go try it again hopefully again that is working correctly Go ahead and check it out, man. Yeah, let's see. Let's go and walk back on outside right quick. See, there she goes. Boom, see that? I just put y'all guys on game, killing it. Hold on, let's look in there. Oh, that's an extra. No, it shouldn't be an extra. Oh, well, my star ceiling did not make it for whatever reason. But we'll fix it. We'll fix it. I don't know why I didn't make it, but we'll fix it. It's an easy fix.
Well, for the most part, yeah, I'll see you, boy. I'm gonna go repeat my same steps and go fix it. Yes, sir. You see that motherfucker looking right? God damn, good. Let me stop my shit, man. I'm being extra now. Matter of fact, I'm gonna fix it while we're doing this video. Fuck it. It's a quick and simple ass fix. Front. Front. Let's do a. Uh, we're gonna do a display, reset the world, um, keep orientation. Sometimes if you can't get it to do what it need, there you go. Just you select something else and it can do what it need to do then. So now that I got it. Then we're just going to redo what I said I was going to do again. Move the axes. Front view. We need help moving something. Boom. Get it. Alright. Mirror. Make sure this is on. Pivots off. Alright. Hit it. Oh, damn, that's way out there. But, uh -huh. It'll be alright. Export. And if it doesn't work this time, then what I'm going to do is I'm going to, um,. I'm going to give it its own separate dummy from the everything else. And then we should be all right. So now y'all actually getting the, the gist of, you know, what could happen. And, you know, then I'm trying to make it a speed through video. Like, this video is 20 minutes long now. <laughs> but you, I done got everything done and right. So now you kind of see how to fix some problems, how to, you know, get certain things together. You know, get things where you want it to be, bro. So, we're going to go back in and we're going to see if this bitch work. <laughs> Let's try it out. Mm. 
Let's hope and pray that this worked this time. I don't see it outside the car, so hopefully it's in there. I just need to come down some. Whoa, what the fuck? Yeah, but she is in there, not unless she's... Yeah, she needs to come down some. But overall, guys, what you guys hope y'all enjoy the tutorial when you go back in Z-Mod just move it down don't put it back in the center of the car just slide it down where you think it might be okay at do not go fucking around with shit I'm telling you like I know <laughs> you move it back to the center you're gonna have to start this whole damn tutorial all over again so just kind of giving everybody a heads up before you go do some shit that you don't want to go do yeah feel me Look at them lights right there, boy. Hold on. One more time. One more time, huh? Oh, shit. Yeah. You see that? Oh, there it go. Yeah. I mean... Oh, you motherfucker. Come down. Better be happy I'm on the damn rocks. That's how we do shit around here. Alright guys, hope y'all enjoyed the video.